Hi! I'm gonna make a little video makeup tutorial for all you guys. Many boys actually wear makeup, but I haven't actually seen that many tutorials for boys on how to apply makeup to bring out the inner beauty that we also, as guys, possess. You all seen how people on commercials always wear extremely expensive makeup. Now, that's bullshit. My makeup, theatrical uh, makeup, you know, like this, things that you can buy in toy stores. So, what we're gonna do first is we are gonna wash our faces to make sure they're completely clean so all the makeup will actually stick. We're just gonna dabble our fingers in this water a little bit and we're just gonna go, you know, like... <laughs> Remember your towel. I'm using a blue towel. I would re recommend a blue because they're the best. Dry it out. Best thing is if it actually hurts a little bit. Then you know you're doing it right. Just scrub it around. There. Quick scrub. Oh, and then we are ready. Now, first of all, most important thing you do is to wear a foundation to smooth out the dark areas we have, a little pimples, little red areas, if you have a rash or something like that. Try to get a foundation which is as close to your own skin color as possible. We don't want to look like we are wearing makeup, we want to make it look completely natural. What we're gonna do is take our ring finger and just apply it to well, this isn't actually my ring finger, <laughs> sorry about that. This is the finger I use when I... Whatever. Many people, most of us actually, have a little dark circles around our eyes because we are stressed out. We live in a, in a world where stress is actually beginning to be something completely natural in our lives. You know, just blend it out. You see how smoothly that is? You can you can you can even see any dark areas around my eyes right now. Nose is usually red because I drink too much. There you go. You see that? You see how natural my skin looks now? Next, we are gonna do our eyes because everybody knows that the eyes represents the soul of a human being. All you need is to bring out your natural beauty with, for instance, a piece of crayon. Crayon isn't exactly made for applying on eyelashes. Be sure that you won't hit uh, the skin of your, your eyelids too much. There, you see that? See how natural that looks? The eyelashes. Now for the eyes. Gentle and discreet little rouge, a little shadow, you know. There. And the other eye. It might take you a longer time because you don't have as much experience in this as I do. There, you see that? You see the effect that has? I must admit, I am a bit of a sucker for the color silver. This will bring out the sparkle from your eyes if you know how to apply it correctly. There, a little bit of silver. And you can call me Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. To go completely crazy here, we are gonna use the color gold, just on top of the silver. Now doesn't that look wonderful and natural? I told you. Use your creativity. Use the color from before, the which I also used in my eyes. Come a little bit on your finger and just brush it up. Keep brushing, keep blending, you can see the effect it has. It just smoothens and smoothens all over my cheekbone with the other side. There you go. Looking at those little apple cheeks. <laughs> mm. Now, let's see what we can fuck with next. Lips, dear boys. Lips. Never forget the lips. The lips should really stand out because you want guys to notice your lips. Mm. Again, any damn fool can use a lipstick, but only a true natural will use a piece of crayon. Remember, 
we don't want to look like we're wearing makeup, we want to look like we have inner natural beauty. Do just like women used to do. Actually, a lot of women who will outline the lips a little further, you know, a little above the, the actually natural uh, lip line. More luscious, more sensual, and just more kissable. So we want that too, just a little bit over the edges of the lip line. Now you see that. I have big lips, yes. And you want to outline the outline. Just a little bit. Little, little bit. Notice how I tighten my lips. Because many women do like this. When they put on lipstick, look like a completed blowfish. That's not the case here. You have to stretch out your lips so all the cracks you have in the lips will also be filled with color. You see that effect? Is that amazing? You see this? You see the effect it has? There you go. Completely and utterly natural. The dramatic effect. To make all this makeup look even more natural, you want to apply a little bit of powder. And remember to use circular motions when you do this. And just, you know, and then, and now you start the blending circular motions. Just relax and just have a little patience and all the makeup will blend in completely and utterly natural. Tip of the day in this tutorial is if you don't have any powder, you simply go to your kitchen and find some white flour and you take a paintbrush and then you just stroke it stroke it, stroke, stroke, stroke. And remember, if you're a boy and you're having a beard and you don't want to get rid of it, you want to keep it, you simply take this flower and just put it all over your beard and people will actually not even notice you have any beard at all. You can stop shaving from now on. You just put flour on there. Just blend it nice and smoothly in. There you go. For the final test, you want to see if your makeup is waterproof. Because maybe it's raining where you're at, maybe you're gonna cry because your boyfriend just broke up with you, who knows, and who cares. It's still standing! Just a little tutorial on how to apply nice, natural, and bring out your inner beauty kind of makeup. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you.